Hello YouTube, my name is Abum and now I will continue about Database and Visual Basic 2010. Here I have insert data and now I will add update data, edit data. Okay, here I copy all this and press CTRL, click and drag. Okay, maybe like this. And now I need hate. Okay. okay, like this. And here, uh, edit maybe, edit data. And ah, sorry, here edit data and username and here I need tb edit un okay maybe like this and here tb edit pass okay and uh, here ptn save or edit okay maybe like this and save okay I have insert and edit data now in here double click and okay okay this is just delete here button pt and insert delete and go again to design double click save data okay now I have pt and edit click okay before I add a function in ptn edit I want to make function to list box double click list box and here I need mm, okay maybe I need okay I double click data grid view and okay here I delete and in DGV member I need information here I need information number okay and cancel it and go back again here and now I add uh, maybe team mm, maybe number as integer and equal t give member dot uh, selected selected cell uh, selected rows dot cell uh, selected rows zero dot cell zero dot value okay if I check in message box NMP. Okay. I try to check and start debugging. Login. Okay. If I click, oh, oh, sorry. 
selected terus dot item oke okay, maybe like this dot item wah dot item zero cell zero maybe like this wow oh. sorry uh, maybe I change to give you member and uh, Hello. Cell click. Okay, maybe like this, and I try again here and delete. Okay, and rows one, row zero. Okay, maybe like this. I try again. I go. Wow. Oke, okay, go to design and select data grid view and I change some parameter here. And I need auto size row, auto size column uh, fill and go to column header visible double click and false ah sorry no mm. Okay, here row header visible. Okay, and I go to here to edit column and in number go to visible and double click false and press OK. Now I just have a username and password and go again here. Uh, selected selection mode and full row select like this and now if I start debugging and Agus 1,2,3,4 if I click I have a number here Okay, now if I get a number, I will add to text box here. Okay, and I go to script, and here I need a function like before, and ah, okay, sorry. Maybe I need. Okay, I go again to here my DB dataset again and right click, add query, use SQL statement next, select next and here query builder and I need username and password and here where and 
where number number equal question mark okay just like this and press okay next and here uh, number and here number okay press next finish okay now go to build build project okay after that I go to this if I click uh, to give data grid view and I have an NP and now I add information to text box and I add db as new and here my db dataset table adapter and dot member table adapter and here I need team and db and equal db dot hmm get data by number and I add a NP NMP I add a number okay just like this and now I add a TB edit username dot tag and equal uh, TB dot rows dot rows zero dot item item one okay like this and I need trim trim okay and copy this okay and here I need pass and item 2 okay if I start debugging login I click now I have Agus and 1 2 3 4 okay in next video I will add function to the button okay if you like my tutorial please subscribe my youtube channel and thanks for watching Goodbye.